Hello, avid viewers and enthusiasts of the glamorous world of entertainment, I'm thrilled to dive into the intriguing tapestry of Jennifer Hudson's life. A multifaceted journey marked by soaring success, dazzling wealth, and the epitome of luxury. In this captivating exploration, we will unravel the financial enigma behind the award-winning singer and actress, delving into the intricacies of her net worth, the opulence of her car collection, and the grandeur of her mansion. All the details you need are right here in this video. Let's dive in now. Jennifer Hudson, the renowned American recording artist, actress, and spokesperson, boasts a substantial net worth of $30 million. Initially catapulted into the spotlight through the acclaimed competition series, American Idol, Hudson has seamlessly transitioned into a multifaceted career spanning both music and acting. Her remarkable achievements include numerous Grammy Awards, an Academy Award, and a Screen Actors Guild Award. Notably, on June 12, 2022, she clinched a Tony Award for her co-production role in the play, A Strange Loop. Officially cementing her membership in the exclusive, EGOT, club a prestigious circle of individuals who have secured an Emmy, Golden Globe, Oscar, and Tony. This esteemed group includes luminaries such as Whoopi Goldberg, John Legend, Audrey Hepburn, and Rita Moreno. Born on September 12, 1981, in Chicago, Illinois, Jennifer Kate Hudson is the youngest of three siblings, hailing from the Englewood neighborhood. After graduating from Dunbar Vocational High School in 1999, she embarked on her educational journey at Langston University. However, contending with homesickness, Hudson made the decision to leave the university and subsequently enrolled at Kennedy King College. Hudson first began singing in her church choir when she was seven years old. Influenced by her grandmother Julia, who introduced her to the world of community theater, Hudson took her initial steps towards stardom. In 2002, she inked her first recording contract with Chicago-based Righteous Records, setting the stage for what promised to be a promising career. However, Fate took a turn when the opportunity to showcase her vocal prowess on American Idol materialized in 2004. This pivotal moment led to the amicable release from her five-year contract with Righteous Records, marking the onset of a new chapter. Her audition for the third season of American Idol in Atlanta was a watershed moment, with her prior experience performing as one of the muses from Hercules on the Disney Cruise Lines underscoring her diverse talents. Hudson's journey on the show was marked by standout performances, including securing the highest number of votes in the top 9 inches round. Despite her elimination in the subsequent top 7 inches round, Hudson's indomitable spirit left an indelible mark, earning her widespread acclaim as one of the greatest contestants in American Idol history. In the aftermath of the competition, the resonance of Hudson's shock exit echoed in the corridors of MTV's rankings where she was deemed the sixth greatest American Idol, with the most shocking exit of all time in 2009. The accolades continued to pour in as the Los Angeles Times, in 2010, positioned Hudson as the third greatest American Idol in the show's history, trailing only behind the inaugural winner, Kelly Clarkson, and the fourth season victor, Carrie Underwood. Post her departure from the illustrious American Idol stage in 2004, Jennifer Hudson embarked on a musical journey that would solidify her status as a powerhouse in the industry. Not one to be deterred by the twists of fate, Hudson engaged in various projects, including a notable duet with Meat Loaf titled, The Future Ain't What It Used To Be. However, it was in November 2006 that she took a significant step forward, signing a record deal with Arista Records. Collaborating with acclaimed producers Ryan Tedder and Timbaland, Hudson meticulously crafted her debut album, releasing the tantalizing single, Spotlight, in June 2008. The eponymous album, Jennifer Hudson, saw the light of day in September 2008, unveiling a collection of tracks written and produced by Nii Yo and Stargate. The album's impactful debut at number 2 on the Billboard 200 signaled the arrival of a new force in the music industry. Critics and fans alike showered the album with praise, leading to its victory in the Best R&B Album category at the 2009 Grammy Awards. Additionally, it earned nominations in two other categories, namely Best Female R&B Vocal Performance and Best R&B Performance by a duo or group with vocals. Jennifer Hudson's musical journey continued to ascend with her second studio album, I Remember Me, released in March 2011, once again claiming the number two spot on the Billboard 200. The momentum persisted with the 2014 release of her album, J-Hud. Demonstrating her resilience and versatility, 
Hudson's ability to captivate audiences through her music remained unwavering. In June 2016, she marked a new chapter in her career by signing with Epic Records, affirming her enduring impact and relevance in the dynamic landscape of the music industry. In November 2005, Jennifer Hudson took a resounding leap into the realm of acting with her breakthrough role as Effie White in the film adaptation of the iconic musical, Dreamgirls. Sharing the screen with luminaries such as Jamie Foxx, Beyoncé, and Eddie Murphy, Hudson's portrayal of Effie White was nothing short of a revelation. Surpassing numerous seasoned singers and actresses, including Fantasia Barino, Hudson garnered widespread acclaim for her stellar performance. Her rendition of, And I Am Telling You I'm Not Going, became an indelible highlight, earning her 29 awards for her portrayal of Effie White, including the Golden Globe Award for Best Actress in a Supporting Role. The BAFTA Award for Best Actress in a Supporting Role, and the prestigious Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress. Recognitions from the Broadcast Film Critics Association and the Screen Actors Guild further solidified her position as a powerhouse in the acting realm. Post, Dreamgirls, Hudson seamlessly transitioned into various film roles, from supporting parts in Sex and the City and The Secret Life of Bees, to lead roles in films such as Fragments, Winnie Mandela, Black Nativity, and the 2019 adaptation of Cats. Adding to her diverse repertoire, Hudson graced Broadway with her presence in The Color Purple in 2015, a performance that earned her a Grammy for Best Musical Theater Album in 2017. Beyond the silver screen and stage, Hudson ventured into the realm of television, assuming coaching roles on The Voice UK during the sixth and eighth seasons, and the American version during the 13th and 15th seasons. The year 2021 marked another milestone in Hudson's illustrious career as she embodied the legendary Aretha Franklin in the film, Respect. The accolades followed suit, with Hudson clinching Entertainer of the Year and Outstanding Actress in a Motion Picture at the NAACP Image Awards. Demonstrating her versatility, Hudson ventured into the realm of talk shows, launching The Jennifer Hudson Show in September 2022. And with so many successes mentioned above, we invite you to admire the extremely luxurious mansion she owns. Mansion in Burr Ridge, step into the world of Jennifer Hudson, where the dazzling lights of fame meet the warmth of home in her magnificent $3 million residence in Burr Ridge. Just 27 miles from the vibrant heart of Chicago, this 12,000-square-foot haven, a testament to Hudson's success, was originally crafted by its previous owners in 2007 before being embraced by the iconic entertainer herself. Housing six bedrooms and seven bathrooms, the residence is adorned in the rich elegance of Brazilian cherry wood, a lavish touch that underwent substantial remodeling to align with Jennifer's refined taste. As one crosses the threshold into the marble-clad foyer, an aura of grandeur envelopes, guided by a floating spiral staircase meticulously painted black by Hudson herself. The residence unfolds with opulent features, including not one but two laundry rooms, a game room, an indoor screening room, and a heated garage sprawling enough to shelter six distinct cars. The architectural prowess of the house is a reflection of both function and sophistication. In a rare glimpse shared with fans in April 2021, the living room, an expansive sanctuary, unfolds with giant ceilings, marble floors, and a curated selection of cream furniture adorned with gold accents. The room, tastefully embellished with mesh curtains, provides a canvas for a grand piano, a testament to Jennifer's musical inclinations. A second peek into her palatial reception room in September unraveled an impeccably decorated living space. The room is adorned with ultra-chic monochrome furniture, where tall ceilings and a spiral staircase seamlessly blend, creating an atmosphere reminiscent of a regal palace. Jennifer Hudson, with her discerning eye for aesthetics, has crafted a living space that mirrors her multifaceted persona, elegant, refined, and steeped in success. The female singer was extremely proud of her achievements, displaying many trophies and awards for guests to admire. Beyond the limelight, Jennifer has curated personalized spaces that reflect her passions and the multifaceted aspects of her life. A dedicated music room stands as a testament to her musical journey, adorned with hanging guitars that echo the melodies of her success. Complementing this is her private office, a domain where she oversees important transactions. While the inner sanctum of her bedroom remains largely private, a glimpse she shared in 2022 unveils a spacious retreat. The room features a built-in wardrobe, abundant clothing, and a plush purple carpet, 
creating an ambiance of comfort and luxury. Notably, the room includes a fireplace, adding a touch of warmth and sophistication, and an ensuite bathroom with a built-in tub that exudes opulence. The heart of the home, the kitchen, epitomizes modernity and functionality. Equipped with state-of-the-art appliances, ample storage in cabinets lining the walls, and a marble top island, the kitchen harmoniously blends practicality with elegance. Neutral tones of beige and taupe create a soothing atmosphere, further accentuating the refined aesthetics of Jennifer's culinary domain. The external grandeur of the residence is equally captivating, with meticulously manicured lawns, pristine stone sidewalks, and a plethora of trees that frame the property. Beyond the walls, Jennifer's palatial home unfolds with an impressive count of 16 different rooms, each narrating a unique aspect of her life, and is adorned with five fireplaces that contribute to the overall ambiance of grandeur and warmth. This house is really beautiful, isn't it, my viewers? Next, let's take a look at her luxury car collection now. Cars. Embarking on a journey through Jennifer Hudson's remarkable car collection offers a glimpse into the intersection of luxury and style. The first jewel in this automotive crown is the BMW X6, a testament to sophistication and performance. The BMW X6, known for its sleek design and powerful engine, stands as a symbol of driving pleasure and cutting-edge technology. With a fusion of athleticism and elegance, this vehicle echoes Jennifer's refined taste and appreciation for automotive excellence. To own this car, you need about $50,000. Moving through the lineup, we encounter the Ford Mustang Mach-E, a dynamic addition that blends iconic design with eco-conscious innovation. As an all-electric SUV, the Ford Mustang Mach-E exemplifies a commitment to a sustainable future without compromising the exhilarating driving experience. This car showcases Jennifer's forward-thinking choices, aligning with the evolving landscape of environmentally conscious and high-performance vehicles. To own this car, you need about $46,000. Number 3 on this automotive journey is the Cadillac Escalade Luxury, a pinnacle of opulence and utility. The Cadillac Escalade Luxury, renowned for its spacious and lavish interior, is a statement of elegance on the road. This SUV combines advanced technology with refined comfort, providing a luxurious driving experience. Jennifer's choice of the Cadillac Escalade Luxury mirrors her penchant for vehicles that seamlessly merge style and functionality. As for this car, it costs about $93,000. Concluding this exploration is the Rolls-Royce Phantom, the epitome of automotive extravagance. The Rolls-Royce Phantom stands as an iconic representation of luxury, craftsmanship, and prestige. This handcrafted masterpiece redefines opulence with its sumptuous interior and unparalleled attention to detail. Jennifer Hudson's inclusion of the Rolls-Royce Phantom in her collection underscores her status as a connoisseur of unparalleled luxury and timeless elegance. As for this car, it costs about $460,000. Each car in her collection becomes a unique chapter, contributing to the narrative of her journey through the lanes of success and luxury. Which car do you like best in this collection? Please comment below. Dear my audience, not only is she a talented woman, Jennifer Hudson also possesses a noble personality as she has participated in many different charity activities for many years, with an estimated amount of donated about $1 million. Jennifer Hudson has been associated with various charitable endeavors and has supported causes close to her heart. One notable initiative she has been involved in is the Julian D. King Gift Foundation, named after her late nephew. The foundation, established in memory of Julian King, focuses on providing support and opportunities for children and young people. Through the Julian D. King Gift Foundation, Jennifer Hudson has been dedicated to promoting education, stability, and positive development for children facing challenges. The foundation has been involved in activities such as organizing back-to-school events, providing school supplies, and supporting various educational initiatives. Jennifer Hudson has also been an advocate for causes related to issues such as childhood obesity and AIDS awareness. Additionally, she has participated in charitable events and fundraisers to support disaster relief efforts and other humanitarian causes. In a powerful collaboration, Jennifer Hudson joined forces with MasterCard in 2021 for a significant initiative aimed at uplifting black women-owned businesses. This partnership, known as the Strivers Initiative, is not just a campaign but a consumer-facing platform with a vital mission. 
The primary goal is to amplify the visibility of black women business owners who are not only navigating challenges but triumphing over obstacles to sustain and expand their enterprises. According to Businesswire, the Strivers Initiative is a noteworthy effort to shed light on the resilience and success of black women entrepreneurs, providing them with a platform to share their stories and accomplishments. This initiative marks a commitment to support and celebrate the remarkable journey of these business owners who contribute significantly to their communities and the broader business landscape. The Strivers Initiative is not merely a concept, it took flight with a national advertising spot. This impactful spot not only showcases black women business owners from various corners of the country but also features the acclaimed Grammy Award-winning singer and songwriter, Jennifer Hudson. Her involvement adds a touch of star power to the initiative, bringing attention to the importance of recognizing and supporting black women entrepreneurs. Personal Life When we talk about the life of Jennifer Hudson, we love her even more for her resilience as a black woman overcoming pain, revealing the complexities that shape people beyond the spotlight stage. In 1999, at the age of 18, she entered a relationship with James Payton, a chapter that unfolded over almost a decade before their separation in late 2007. However, Love found its way back into Hudson's life when she met David Otunga, a professional wrestler in the WWE and a Harvard Law graduate. Their connection led to an engagement in September 2008, and in August 2009, Hudson welcomed her first child, a son named David Daniel Otunga Jr. The journey of motherhood, however, took an unexpected turn when, in November 2017, Hudson and Otunga decided to part ways. Tragedy struck the Hudson family in a devastating manner on October 24, 2008. Jennifer's mother, Darnell Donerson, aged 57, and her brother, Jason, aged 29, were found shot to death inside the Chicago home they shared with Jennifer's older sister, Julia. This heart-wrenching incident led to a harrowing search for Jennifer's seven-year-old nephew, Julian King, with an Amber Alert issued when he was reported missing. Sadly, three days later, the FBI confirmed that Julian had been found dead on Chicago's west side, succumbing to multiple gunshot wounds. The perpetrator, William Balfour, Julius' estranged husband, was charged with three counts of first-degree murder and one count of home invasion. Convicted on all charges in July 2012, he received three life sentences without parole, followed by an additional 120 years for other convictions. Out of this tragedy, Jennifer Hudson and her family emerged as advocates for justice and support. The Hudson King Foundation for Families of Slain Victims was established to honor the memory of the three victims. Additionally, Jennifer and her sister created the Julian D. King Gift Foundation, a beacon of hope that provides Christmas presents and school supplies to families in need in the Chicago area. Amidst personal trials, Jennifer's commitment to making a positive impact extends beyond her family's foundation. Described as a friend of former President Barack Obama, she stood by his side at a fundraiser in Beverly Hills during his first term in May 2009. Her advocacy for social causes resonated further when she performed at the White House during the Celebration of Music from the Civil Rights Movement event. She really deserves more love from us, doesn't she, my audience? Thank you for watching the entire video. Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this, and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.